What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I am back with some more PvP action. Now it would be live but the live footage you are seeing in the background now. The audio messed up on it and it's my own fault because I didn't do the normal checks I normally do. So I was stupid high pitched, even more high pitched than what I normally am. You couldn't hear the game sound and it was just absolutely ruined but it was a great great gameplay of me using a weapon which I want to discuss today. Well just absolutely steamroll the opposition now before we get into the video guys if you do enjoy it leaving a like really does help out and if you are new around here and daily destiny videos is what you want to see be sure to subscribe okay so the weapon i am using within today's video is nothing other than the black scorpion 4sr now i made a video about a week ago of me using the forsaken's version of the black scorpion 4sr which was okay you can see it on screen now i mean it wasn't the best weapon in the world in my opinion even though you can get random rolls on it uh, my version it just didn't have enough stability because this thing fires so quick I mean it's got 260 rounds per minute rate of fire so it shoots relatively fast for a scout rifle it even shoots quicker when like this is amazing it shoots quicker than the Suze regime when it's in its slow mode but does more damage while it's there shooting quicker I think it does like 47 to the head it's absolutely murderous people now I said in that video the black scorpion 4 SR I found its sweet spot within the medium to big maps I mean close quarter maps you're just gonna get murdered by last words uh, not forgotten lunas house shotguns for days some SMGs some auto rifles now they've got a buff so yeah medium to big maps this just stands out above the rest it really does now I made a video on the black scorpion and I loved it I did really like the one I had but then I realized people you can actually get the older version from your collections, which is this one you can see on screen now, which is the one I'm using in the gameplay in the background. And it has much more stability. Now you'd think, oh yes, it needs range, it needs range, it needs this and the other, it's a scout, yeah, it shoot, it's for long distance uh, shooting, it needs range. But because it fires so quick and because it's full auto, I don't think it needs as much range as people are thinking. With more stability, it's much of a better weapon. I mean, like, I said this in my other video, I mean, at range, it's bouncing. If you try and, where, where, where its sweet spot is with the medium to long range fighting battles and um, gun battles, you need stability because it does bounce all over the place. Now, the one you can buy out of your collections, people, it allows you to have much more stability than the version I had and many other variants you can get within the Forsaken as a random drop from the gunsmith because that's where this comes. So you can head to your collections and for 500 Glimmer, uh, I think it's five Legendary Shards and five uh, gunsmith materials, you can pick out this Black Scorpion for SR and give it a try. People, now the uh, gameplay you're seeing in the background now, this was me recording live and it was my first game demonstrating this weapon to you. I mean, this map isn't exactly a... Well, a, a massive map. I mean, it's relatively close quarters battles all over the place. I mean, if you're coming to here with a last word, a Luna's Howling, Not Forgotten, there ain't much which can touch you. But me demonstrating how good of a weapon this was on my first gameplay showcasing it to you guys, I got a wee run out of medals. I got 30 odd kills. I got a 20 kill streak, 6.8 efficiency. I was absolutely tearing pitches apart. I really was. And like I said, it's just a scout rifle nobody knows about, nobody's using. I mean, I've come across one person using this within all the PvP I've played, and that was actually within my last uh, Black Scorpion 4SR uh, Forsaken variant for, uh, video, which I posted about a week ago. So yes, guys, I definitely recommend you guys grabbing this from your vault or your, from your collections if you haven't got it in your vault. Check it out, I mean, and just give it a go in PvP. And let me know down below in that comment section what you think about it. If you have a variant of this from the... Forsaken and it's got decent stability on it with say Rampage or sort of mouse try it out guys I couldn't recommend it to you more I mean it's a great great weapon but remember medium to big maps I mean close quarter maps if you're trying to use this and you're coming up against weapons like the last word there uh, you ain't gonna stand a chance I mean you'll probably get a couple of kills but it's just it's made for long range maps it really is now I've said this to you a million times I mean you guys tell me this and basically all of my live pvp gameplays that I suck in pvp I'm a scrub I'm garbage and you're right I mean my kda is only a 1.81 or 1.82 I mean I've had it up to two before but because you guys know I like to play around in pvp because I play pvp for fun 
I like to mess around with these other weapons and see what's good and what ain't. I don't stick to the standard Lunas Howl shotgun heavy. I don't stick to the last word sniper heavy. I don't do that. I mess around. I ain't even got my last word yet, people. I haven't even got my last word yet. That's how much I care about that weapon. I mean, I played enough of it within Destiny 1. I ain't bothered about it within Destiny 2. I know it's a great weapon. I see everybody murder with it. I mean, like, I mean, I've used it for a couple of games, but it isn't going to be my go-to weapon. I mean, I ain't really a fan of hand cannons. I mean, I've got the Lunas Howl. Don't really enjoy it that much. I prefer pulse rifles. I prefer my last perdition. I prefer weapons that nobody else uses. And the Black Scorpion 4 SR is definitely one of those weapons nobody else uses. But guys, if you have found any other weapon since the latest patch, which has turned that weapon into a great, great weapon like it has the Black Scorpion, let me know what it is down below in that comments section. Or you could always tweet me at DPJSC08. That is linked within the video description as always as well, guys. But I cannot recommend this Black Scorpion Forest R to you enough. If you have a new variant of it which gives you decent stability, try it out. If you haven't, but still would like to try it out, go into your collections. And it's got, I mean, you've got to have had this in year one, guys. You've got to have it in year one. I mean, if and if you have, you'll be able to grab this from your collections. It is as simple as that, guys. But yeah, I'm just going to end the video right here, right now. Shame this gameplay. The sound is a bit, well, the sound isn't muffled. It's absolutely broken. But hey, at least you had something to watch while I was talking about this weapon. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Try this out in PvP. Let me know what you think about it down below in that comment section. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.